Hi, this is Micro Kid again, and in the last video, I um put popping candy under the microscope with um with some water, uh, but we didn't know very much. So we looked up some ideas, and we know how popping candy works and what it actually is. Well, it is a um sugar crystal. It's a bit like the honeycomb stuff under really 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 hot uh, with um bubbles of carbon dioxide with really in a really really high pressure and when the water goes in like it's happening now it's gonna explode it the carbon dioxide tries to come out and it's, and bursts open which is how you get that crackle and snaps and pop and um as you can see here you can get see like little like boom boom booms coming up and that see like that 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 big bubble that you saw is a bubble of carbon dioxide not the stuff we breathe oxygen the stuff we breathe and when we breathe out carbon dioxide, the bubbles is what we breathe out. So, imagine this as a sugar crystal and then carbon dioxide on, on high pressure inside it. And then, as soon as, whoop, that was a big bubble. As soon as it comes, the carbon dioxide reaches out because when water hits um water or spit hits um sugar crystals they just melt the carbon dioxide is left to just explode and the people that make popping candy make it by um melting sugar crystals heating it up melting it um, like I said, and then they put um, carbon dioxide bubbles and really high pressure underneath it. And because, like, when you go underwater, high pressure goes on um, sometimes on your ears and it hurts your ears because they're on such a high pressure, which is pushing them down. The bubbles can't push up to the top, and then they cool it down. And it forms the crystal, and then they break it into tiny bits, and it forms this crystal thing. And then they put it in the popping candy bags, and send it away, and we eat it. Bye. Hope you like this.